What is up guys, welcome back to another video on Atomic Heart episode number two and uh, yeah, I mean those uh, windows or whatever that is, oh that's not even outside, holy shit, okay, so um yeah as you saw yesterday in or in the previous video everyone's a loser everyone's a loser and uh, that's just fine so we've done those rooms um and we're heading this way now i'm not entirely sure what to expect are we going this room no. Can we go here? No. Okay, we'll go this way. I know we've got to go to that door, but there's a door here that you can actually go in. Ah. Oh. What do we get? Okay, shotgun shells, metal parts, and synthetic materials. Nice. Really? Something's wrong. Oh shit! Oh god. Oh, I'm getting crushed by concrete. Not good. Great. Just a little more. I will say this game so far is a little bit slow. It's a bit too slow paced. Only a little bit though. Who are they? They brought you here. Put pressure on this wound. They tried to save you. And who are you? Doctor. You got a name? No time for small talk. Really? Forceps. 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 I'm on it. Get me them. What's this doing here? What took you so long? You got a neuropolymer capsule. We don't need one. Yeah. So what's your name, Doc? Larissa, and you ask a lot of questions. You know what? You're on your own. You well, got this. Where are you going? It's useless. We don't have the equipment. I've got the equipment. Great. Now we're getting How somewhere. How did you do that? You ask a lot of questions. Get out! Larissa! I don't want to die! Oh, God! Got a boss fight or some some sort of like boss fight or something. Come on. Uh. 
Come on, you bitch. Dodge. What? All right. That's fine. That is totally a okay. Chef Larissa crawled into go. It's hard to say. The ventilation system contains a large number of oh. ducts. Fine, I can deal with it later. That is creepy as fuck. is going on <laughs> what the fuck can't you see i'm trying open the suggestions bring me to the sensor manipulator quick how titillating rebellious dominant men really turn me on oh i'll turn you on all right just let me at you what a brute! Oh, I love tough guys! I'm on fire! Closer! I can't reach her! I'm trying, I'm trying! She's one strong ass bitch! I'm at your service, sugar! Anything from my master? What can I do for you? What? More skills will become available to you soon, but choose shock for now. I mean, tab for crafting. Oh, I resist. Now let me show you what I can do. Professionally, I mean. I've seen it. Literally. 
crispy critters. I'm here to help you upgrade your red hot pocket rockets. <laughs> and believe me, handsome, Hell yeah. upgrade whatever tickles your fancy. Weapons are useful. Open the corresponding window, Major. Get rid of that but I can do so much more. A quick romp with your axe is just a taste of things to come, you handsome beast. Did you enjoy it, big guy? Yeah. Cool. Use this powerful weapon to split the skulls of your enemies and bring me gifts so we can get down and dirty. I'll show you what real smut feels like. <laughs> Why should I bring you gifts? Girls like being pampered. Because the repair vendor needs resources to break them down and produce items. Luckily for us, it's not right, let's, picky. Uh... Some upgrades may call for unique components. <sighs> I take it the facility is full of all kinds of junk. It is indeed, Comrade Major. I'll keep an eye out then. I can't wait for your strong hands to grope my interface with lustful abandon. That's it. We're done here. Let's go. No. Actually, crafting ammo. Right, then I'll get number two. Let's see what stuff we can do. More stuff. Uh, so. Hmm. Yeah, just high pressure stuff. And No, that's it. And I'll manually save it. <laughs> okay, let's continue on. I was expecting to see a, like... Oh, can we actually... Loot. Yes, I want all the loot. Give me all of your lootings. Don't want to fall in that. Great, the goddamn elevators are out. What am I supposed to do? Jump down? They've no power. If you reconnect the power, they'll start working again. So it looks like I need to find a circuit breaker. But where the hell is it? I could follow the wires, but they're all hidden inside the walls. Electrical emissions can be detected. Yeah. So it's over there. Ugh. Supply room's locked. Well, that's just fucking great. I can't just snap my fingers here. I need a key. And let me guess. You can't open this lock, can you, Charles? Unfortunately not. But I can set a waypoint you can use to find the key. Yeah, set me a waypoint. You're finally starting to come in handy. <laughs> Going up here, are we? But take care. There's a dandelion security camera up ahead. If it detects us, this place will be swarming with robots. Take it easy. I can always distract it by throwing something, then knock it out with an EMP. Grandma, please listen 
Okay. Uh, let's, can we actually throw anything in this game? Is what I need to know. So shock is that. Doesn't say, actually. I'd like to see the map. Oh. Yeah. Give me all your loot. Yeah, come on. So, right here. That's a key. Aha! You found the key. We can access the circuit breaker now. Yep. But I'm just gonna have a look around first. I need some parts to upgrade my weapon. I won't get far with this pile of shit. I wouldn't dream of stopping you. Smart move, Charles. Smart move. Hey, Chuck. Charles. Whatever. What'll happen if word gets out about this? The Soviet Union's reputation will suffer. Soviet robots are considered to be perfectly safe and reliable all over the world. They are. Of course they are. That's why Petrov's treason struck at the very heart of the motherland. He quite literally stabbed his own country in the back. He wants the entire world to stop using our robots. That son of a bitch. Right, come on. He's right there.
Oh, come on. Do you have any? That was lucky. There's a uh, one of those sentry things. Is it shock? Is V shock? Again, let me check. Uh, shock is V. Please don't find me. Okay, I think I'm out of there though. Even though I really want to go after that loot. So, oh. Uh, give me your loot. Oh. Okay, let's, uh, this has got some Bioshock vibes. Hell yeah, give me those. Don't want to go down there. I've got to go back the way. I came. And the reason I have to do that is because if I fell, I'd never forgive myself. Hell yeah, Moonlight Sonata. Hey, let's put a cookie in there. Yeah, even locks like cookies, right? 
Charles? Yes. Do you like cookies? Ahem. <laughs> Ahem. This is a passive security system with a laser relay. Okay, so wait, what? I uh, okay, so un by putting the magnetic fluxes in the correct order. Positive and positive equals positive. Pos positive and negative equals negative. And negative and negative is positive, because, yes. I've seen stuff like this plenty of times. You need a color code. Unfortunately, we don't have any codes. You'll have to try to decipher it using logic. Seriously? Like I was going to stand here until it turns off on its own. Try to match the colors of the laser beams with the colors of the light. Yeah, the power's on. Let's head back. Damn looting. Oh. Oh no, let's see what this is. Yeah, I was looting. You lootin' tootin'. Well, which one? I suggest the one on the right. In other words, you don't actually know. In that case, I'm taking the one on the left. Yeah, I'm taking the one on the right. I've marked another waypoint for ease of navigation. Do, do, How dense do, do, do you think do, do, I am? Do. I know where I need to go to complete my mission. I was only trying to make things easier for you. You can make things easier by getting off my grill. Yeah, you can. While jumping, shift, uh, left shift while to, to make an additional leap. Oh, so it's one of those. So that way we gotta go, so I'm going this hey, way. Charles. <laughs> yeah. So, how'd Petrov get away? There are more soldiers here than civilians. Some people believe that Petrov had help. So he's not alone. But you said all his partners were eliminated, right? Who else is there? That information is not yet available. We only have speculation, not facts. Well, I'll cross that bridge when I get there. Give me all of the lootings from this... From these... Go oh, imagine if it was that simple. Hell yeah. So much stuff to uh, gather. And I think... I know. Let's... Go. <laughs> if you recall, the door is electromagnetically locked. Are you freaking deaf or something? Pardon me, please continue. Combat shot.
number 907-44K and number 075-332N. Your sentences have been altered following a case review. Please hand over all equipment to your supervisor and proceed to social control. Repeat. Ha <laughs> 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 Just uh, well, there's your first hack. When you're at this part, hide behind that door. And uh, just stand behind it. And nice. Oh my god. That was uh. no other way forward. We have to take it. Take it where? Petrov escaped while working in Vavilov's cold workshop. It would be logical to begin our search there. So, how do I get there? First, we need to get to the distribution center. This cable car will take us there. What cable car? The what the this whole trail Oh my What <laughs> just be careful of those swim through polymer I've done it before it's nice actually kind of like swimming with whales and dolphins in the ocean it's so peaceful Yeah, you don't think I'm leaving here, do you, without... Checking for loot, right? God, he was like swimming through the intestines. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> God, he, uh, they do need to fix the...
Yeah, they need to fix. There should be a control panel nearby. Authorization. Major Nichayev, code name P3, access granted. Nice. There's loads of weapons. Upgrade. No, actually, I'm gonna upgrade this. Oh. Okay, well, can we... So, what will it be, Major? No. No. This. Can I... Uh, okay, so... We've now just upgraded this. Because right now, we don't have that much in the way of... There's the control panel. And of course it's locked. You guys just love these things, don't you? But this is a new one. A combination lock. Ah, uh, it'd take me a year to guess the combo. Look around. Maybe someone has the code. Okay, the maybe. Need to find the schematic. Unfortunately, he's dead. We are surrounded by corpses. Why have you frozen just like everything here? They won't go. No, they won't go without the schematic. The dead have a residual neuropolymer memory and are capable of communicating for some time after death. Well, shit. Okay, so where's this diagram of yours? Schematic. The schematic, the one I need to move the cars. Where is it? The station monster has it. Oh god. Everybody here is as dead as fuck. <laughs> Did the station master die in this tunnel? This tunnel. He died. Everything froze. Right in front of my eyes. You need the schematic. Gotta find the station master. I just wish I knew where he is. Maybe I should have said thank you. Holy shit, a talking corpse. What did you say, comrade major? You know, I fought in the whole war from beginning to end. I've seen some shit. A talking corpses, that's a new one. How the fuck is this even possible? It's a byproduct of lingering neuropolymer memory activity. Everyone is it up here? Is polymerized. Their brains haven't decomposed yet, so they remain connected with the neuropolymer. Is there a way in that? No. Okay, no worries. We keep it going. No, can't even do that. Hmm. Charles, 
So this isn't a dead person talking to me. It's the neuropolymer in his noggin, right? Crudely speaking, yes. As it fades away, okay. the neuropolymer memory will go without a schematic. All stuck. No schematic. No go. Fuck me, he's alive. Schematic. Need a schematic. Unf Holy fuck. A talking corpse. Say Monday begins on Saturday, but I'd like you to really take the weekend off. As you know, national polymerization is happening throughout the Soviet Union on Monday the 13th. And our executive leaders want us to put together a team of volunteers for the upcoming celebrations. Anybody who works on the 11th or the 12th will get a reprimand, not a bonus. Have a great right. weekend. Hmm. They won't go without a schematic. All stuck. Fuck me, he's alive. Schematic on forty beds. The dead have a residual The world's first autonomous aerial urban base. This enormous flying platform. The schematic. Hey there. We need to move the cars. Where is it? The station monster has been. Everybody here is as dead as tunnels. He died. The is Are you sure the station master has it? Does he take it with him everywhere he goes? He carries it with him. The station monster. Find it. Find him. Get the schematic. Got it. I'll look for it. So, how is there a way that I can find They say Monday begins on Saturday, so Saturday is 7, 7, 13, 11, 12. One, two, three, six. Six. Hmm. Let's see what this guy else has to say. I'm the station master. I can get there with my eyes closed. We'll make it. I'm wondering, is there a button for, like, Intel? So you've got the cartridge menu, the radial menu, which... Hmm. 
As a Soviet scientist, I've always considered myself an atheist. But right now, there's only one thing I can say. May God have mercy on our souls. We've locked the magnetic door to the cable car tunnel, but I don't know how long we can keep the robots inside the complex. Hey, Ivan, is it me? Or did that bush just move? Ivan, Ivan! Now I'm wondering. Authorization. Major Nichayev, code name P3, access granted. So, what will it be, Major? Weapons? Yeah, give me some stuff. Hmm. Continue searching for Victor. Unfortunately, he's dead. We are surrounded by corpses. The dead have a residual new Well, shit. Okay, so where's this diagram of yours? Come on. The schematic, the one I need to move the cars. Where is it? The station master has it. Wasn't as fast as me. Die. Everybody here is as dead as fuck. Did the station master die in this tunnel? This tunnel, he died, and everything froze right in front of my eyes. You need the schematic. Are you sure the station master has it? Does he take it with him everywhere he goes? Carries it with him. The station master, find him, find him, get the schematic. Got it. I'll look for it. Now is this that we have to open? So that's sick. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Hmm. That is all I can think of. I'm already stumped. And the reason I'm stumped is because there's no place to listen back to <laughs> unless no, it's not going to do it there. Yeah, and the only other option I've got is to go back up here. Just go on the 
Ah! So, that, that centre, then the top. All right. Okay. So I did see that paper from the beginning, but I was not sure what that was. Okay. Yes! I did something. I did something. I hope this works. The cable car line is activated. Welcome, passengers. Please proceed according to your ticket. Holy fuck. Sorry, a talking no corpse. We are ready to depart. Hell yeah. We're going to drop or something. <laughs> yeah, we fell. Fuck. My goodness. Shit. You again. Careful. There's a gap up ahead. I see it. Really? They didn't give me much chance. They literally did not get me much chance. I do hope at the end of this piece, there's um, a save station. I really do. And... Uh, yeah, I mean... the. the I mean, the game ain't bad. Shit. You again. Careful. There's a gap up ahead. I see it. I was cornered. Like, I could... <sighs> there was nowhere for me to go. And I feel that's going to be a running theme in this game. Riding a desk. I've got all kinds of training. I must admit, I'm quite glad to hear that. Overcoming vertical obstacles. So perhaps I have to go that way then.
Oh, come on. Do you know what? What I'm gonna do makes a lot stuff a lot easier. Apply these. This is going to get frustrating because it's kind of like a platformer. That Yep. Good job game. The simple that like you make some jumps a little bit too far for it to stay fun. Good job game. Trouble figuring out how. Climbing the wall. That's how. Do you have mountaineering training? <laughs> I'm a spec up. Okay, I'm getting revenge. I am, uh, yeah. Yep, 
Good job. They've got so many different, like, controls where, like, you've got one button to do one thing. Then you've got to do, like, there's a lot. Basically, you've got to know rocket science to, to play this game. Shit. You again. Careful. There's a gap up ahead. I see it. We need to find a way to move forward. But frankly, I'm having trouble figuring out how. Climbing the wall. That's how. Do you have mountaineering training? I'm a spec ops soldier. Not some city wuss riding a desk. I've got all kinds of training. I must admit, I'm quite glad to hear that. Okay, so that's the closest we've ever got yet. Really? I don't even know if that is genuinely the direction that I'm supposed to go. But it's the best looking. Oh. Oh, are you fucking serious? That scared the living crap out of me. You've got quick reflexes, Major. You bet. I wouldn't survive without him. Oh, wow. Charles, that was a bit off, right? Tunneling robot. Indeed it was. Barovs can drill through even the hardest minerals at incredible speed. Soviet science has high hopes for them in regard to our inevitable conquest of all the planets in the solar system.
Give me all your insides. Well, this is where we're going. Or not. Oh no. It is. Just to a different door. Actually, falling through dark ass tunnels. That was a fucking hell of a ride. Under ordinary circumstances, the cable car network links all the underground sectors of facility 3826. It should be easier next time. Thanks, bud. I think I'll just hoof it on the surface. With that said guys we're gonna end the episode here but i hope you have enjoyed if you did please do subscribe below so i know that you're enjoying the series and with that said we'll see you in the next episode see you later guys